So for the record, what's what's your feeling on punching Nazis? Well, I believe that pies are greater than fists. In fact, recently, I was, uh, a little while ago, I was invited to uh, participate in the Libertarian uh, Freedom Festival of Pennsylvania, which was not, not sort of, but sort of part of uh, their state convention. They staked it a little bit. Yep. And um, I, I, I sent them over to Philip and... And uh, you know they, they, they couldn't afford my uh, my reasonably reasonable fees. And that was sort of off the table, so I wasn't going to go. So that, that that's cool. Um, you know, I mean, I, I'd love to go, but I, I ain't going nowhere unless they're paying me. You know what I'm saying? And then I had heard that they had invited this uh, character August Invictus, who's a full-on fascist fucking asswipe from Florida, who sort of latched onto the Libertarian Party. Mm. And so he was going to give a speech, and then uh, so. Then this gentleman, Will, Col- uh, Will Coley, um, a, a very respected, I, I respect him as a libertarian uh, person. He was a, a vice presidential candidate for a bit, and, um, and so he stepped up and um, offered to debate uh, Augustus. Then I offered to, to moderate, and, and with pies and seltzer and glitter. Um, but they, they turned all that down, sadly. But, uh, but then Antifa got involved. And then, you know, they had put out um, some sort of public uh, statement or, or something. So I, I reached out to them um, with this idea that I would try and um, turn, you know, if it was going to be a public street uh, fracas, my, like the deplorables. You know, I pointed out my concern that, you know, innocent libertarian kids might get punched in the head or whatever. And um, they responded. And... Um, you know, like I said, I, I had a vision of uh, going down there with several cases of whipped cream and a whole shit ton of uh, tin foil pie tins and uh, try and turn it into a huge fucking pie fight. Oh, so the so the tin foil was was not for hats. It was for no, for pies. no, they're, they're like uh, aluminum pie tins. Well, we're talking about libertarians here, who I know are good people, but you know, we would go back to Alex Jones and all that. I mean, they they do wear the tinfoil hats every, or, or they tend to. I, I don't know. I I, I they're think good you people. want to wear tinfoil hats, and the conspiracy theories get to your head. Well, I that's, mean, that's what I hear. I mean, that's why they want to wear the tinfoil hats. It keeps the conspiracy rate oh, down. Oh, and well, it keeps the lizard people out. I mean, that's keeps the lizard that's people. That's why. That's why my boot is lined with tinfoil at all times. Well, I'm, I, I, I personally... It also improves my Wi-Fi signals. <laughs> Multiple reasons to have tinfoil in the lining of your boot. Of course, you've got to be careful during lightning storms. It is mine. This is all right. It is mine. Fight's a good fight. Twist it up. Tear it down. Laughing at you. The killer's friend.